All right, let's add one third plus one fifth. Here's how you do it. What we need to do is get a common denominator here. So we want these to be the same because if we have common denominator, the denominator is the same. We just add the numerators and we're done. So why don't we do this? We could take three times five. So three times five here and five times three over here. So that way we'd have 15 here and 15 here. But we can't just multiply the denominator by three. We need to multiply the numerator by three. That's because three divided by three is one. So we're gonna change the value just the way it's represented. Over here, let's do five over five. And now five times one is five. Five times three is 15 plus one times three, that's three. Five times three is 15. So we have the same denominator. We're just gonna add these numerators. Five plus three, that equals eight. And we just keep the denominator the same. Since these are the same, we don't change that when we add fractions. We end up with eight fifteenths. So one third plus one fifth, that equals eight fifteenths. That's how you do it. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.